foresaw what happened last week on television. The Cuban attacking Leo Burke with the chair, splitting him wide open. That wound has reopened. And now it looks as though we're going to have an unscheduled rematch. Don't go away. Nobody's going for coffee right now, I can tell you. The Cuban assassin, he's got the watch off. It looks as though he's ready to go. Leo Burke in his wrestling tights. What the Cuban assassin. Jerry Morrow is trying to restrain the Cuban. Paul Color has now climbed into the ring to the aid of Leo Burke, and it looks like Jerry Morrow wants to get involved in this action as well. And here come the Cuban Commandos. This was not part of the program, folks, and here comes Jerry Morrow in the hard way. And just like that, Morrow is able to get out of town in a hurry. Here's Morrow running to the rescue, or running rather, running to the safety net provided by Frenchie Martin. The Cuban assassin and Jerry Morrow, they have touched off a powder keg here in the Maritimes with World Grand Prix Wrestling. The promoter, Emile Dupre, is trying to help straighten things out. Cuban assassin is back on the ring apron. Now Harley Race is climbing into the ring. Ready to attack Leo Burke. And we've got another unscheduled bout underway. This is an all-out brawl, ladies and gentlemen. And here we go again. Here we go. We've got one, two, three, eight, nine men in the ring. Leo Burke, his head, is once again gushing blood. And the Cuban assassin goes out over the top rope, thanks to Phil LaFleur, dressed in street clothes. And the Beast is now attacking Jerry Moore. There you see Ron Starr trying to split open the head of Leo Burke. Paul Peller in to help out Leo Burke. Harley Race is taking a licking at the hands of rocker Wayne Gillies. And Harley Race is on his way out of town. Leo Burke now going after King Harley Race. And oh my! Pier 6 Crawl here on World Grand Prix Wrestling. Leo Burke and Harley Race back into the middle of the ring. I can't believe it. I've never seen such uncontrolled fury, such unrestrained action. Leo Burke and King Harley Race. Oh, my! The King has certainly been crowned on that occasion. And Leo Burke is still standing. still standing we'd like to get over and get a word with Leo Burke if it is at all possible Cuban assassin I treated you better than my own brother I brought you to my house I fed you and you turned your back on me remember one thing I never asked you to be my partner you asked me remember that Cuban assassin We'll be right back with more.